Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. Uh, today, I'm going to actually be going through what milk molars do and uh, how they help you out in your game. Uh, this is something that I actually didn't know right off the bat. I saw them around the, the landscape and you know, I always wonder what they did. And when I stumbled across them, I'm like, oh, that makes tons of sense. So I just thought it'd be actually helpful to share this information. Um, it'll be a really quick video just to kind of show you what you did. Um, I actually just finished raiding the ant pile over here that's at the beginning of the game. I think I might do a video on that next on, uh, you know, kind of how to cl clear that out and it's pretty easy actually. Uh, just a little intimidating at first. I finally worked up the courage to do it. Uh, so back to milk molars. Um, so. Uh, I have a few collected already. Uh, keep in mind, if you want to do milk molars, um, you actually have to have um, the correct tool. So you have to have a stage two hammer um, to kind of show what that hammer entails. Um, you're going to need um, stink bug parts, uh, berry leather, and uh, the the boiling gland. Um, these actually aren't too hard to get once you actually figure out a few tricks on how to get those. Um, you know, if anyone needs help on kind of how to get the stink bugs uh, early on in the game. It, it, there's a few things you can do um, that I figured out that are pretty helpful. Um, that said though, so let's focus back to milk molar. So uh, when you do collect your milk molars, um, all you do is you actually go to one of these terminals, the, the ASL terminal, and over here to the far right, you're going to have a molar infusion upgrade. So if you go ahead and select this and load, this is where you can actually spend your milk molars for items that help you out in the game. Um, one of the cooler ones that I've noticed are the max active mutations. So you're going to find out that as you do things in the game, you get mutations and those mutations help you out um, in your game. Um, and one of the more things that kind of are a little bit, uh, I would say, uh, time consuming is running around and oh, shoot, I forgot to change my mutation. But this is one way you can do that. Uh, so I actually have one right now available. Um, I'm thinking of saving it for another mutation. Um, I think I actually might do that or should I go ahead and go with healing? You know what? I've upgraded my armor recently, so I'm actually gonna go ahead and go with uh, Hunger thirst and drain. Uh, you know what? I don't even have enough So I don't even know what I'm talking about right now. Well that said, um, you know I hope you find this video helpful if I do get a few more milk molars, maybe I can spend it uh, Mega m m milk molars. They're very similar to the others. They just look a little bit different You find them on the map the same way. They're just not as common. All right, well, I hope uh, this video, this information helps you out fairly quickly. I know it's a quick video, and uh, I hope I had something to spend for you, but apparently I do not. Well, um, you all have a great rest of your day. Thank you.